afternoon everybody and welcome back to the vlog today is friday it is january 28th and we are out right now it's almost two o'clock in the afternoon we finished up with school and we did lunch at home all of that stuff and now we're out josh had to run a couple of the errands so we rode along with him um, and i have to run into the store while we're out and then the girls and i with well, the two oldest girls and i have a haircut today at 3 30 which josh won't be with us when we do the haircuts because after we are done with the errands we're gonna drop him off by the house. He's gotta get in his truck. Go to Home Depot, pick up our cabinets because they came in, our kitchen cabinets came in, I think Wednesday. Um, so he's gonna go pick those up. It's just like the top cabinets, like I told y'all before, and the bottom ones we're just going to paint. We just wanted bigger ones on the top. So I went with the white. So he's gonna go pick those up. We're gonna go get our hair cut. And then this morning I also put vegetable soup in the crock pot, so that's gonna be cooking. Um, so we'll just eat that tonight, probably with cornbread. I'm guessing probably cornbread is what we'll do. All right, so it is a little while later now. We just dropped Josh off with his truck. He's going to Home Depot, and we are headed to get our hair cut. So we've got a driver. She's driving us to get our hair cut, so that shouldn't take too long, I hope, hopefully. Since we have an appointment and all, hopefully it won't take too long just to get our hair trimmed. I haven't had my trim. I haven't had my hair trimmed in, oh man, I don't know. October, November. It's been quite a while. I usually go every few months and try to get a trim. It's easier to take care of when it's like that. So we're going to go do that real quick and then come back home for the night. All right, y'all, so it is now the next day. Josh is in the kitchen again, working on those cabinets, getting the shelves built. It's looking so good in there. I'm excited to have it done. We can't go in the kitchen and use it right now. Also, the guy that's putting in our wood stove is here. So he's in our living room putting that in. So I'm hanging out with the little ones in the bedroom. Is she eating that? So we're just kind of hanging out here. He's probably gonna be here all day. I think Josh said probably it'll probably last until like sometime tonight he'll be here putting that in, which we can just hang out. Yeah, we can just hang out here in a little bit. I'll sneak into the kitchen and fix us some lunch. And we can also hang out in the living room. Like, we don't have to be out of there all day because he'll be in kind of the fireplace working in there and not in the actual living room. I'm just trying to keep the little kids out of the way so they can work. But we're excited to have everything done. Uh oh, I heard somebody in the other room. So while they're working, I snuck down here in the basement to blow dry my hair. That way the big girls can hold Millie. I need to, it's mostly dry. The roots are kind of wet. I'm going to blow dry it straighten it real quick yesterday when i went for a haircut i just got my layers trimmed up nothing major sometimes i'll like I'll, after a while i'll get my hair cut off short like to my shoulders but it's been a long time since i've done that i've been letting it kind of grow long i don't know i don't know if i'll get it cut short again i kind of like the long hair but we'll see all right so i'm ready now instead of straightening my hair i just kind of crimped it it's really easy to use this thing i've had this thing probably about six or seven years and it says i don't even know what you call them i beach wave maybe and it's from Revlon I got it from Walmart probably like six or seven years ago once in a while I'll bring it out and use it but I keep it in the basement or I keep it in the basement in case the older girls want to use it for their hair and I just forgot about it so while I was down here I was like I'm just going to do that instead of straightening my hair because it's just as easy to run through my hair so I'm ready now so I'm gonna take Millie back upstairs it's getting close to lunch time so I need to figure out what we're going to do for lunch now did you have fun with you yeah you're gonna slobber on Kylie's bed hmm you going to slobber on Kylie's bed? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so it is several hours later now, and I'm in the kitchen. I'm trying to make myself a ice latte. Um, I'm trying something a little bit different. I have this Planet Oat oat milk, um, and it's actually the vanilla flavor. I've only tried, like, the plain one, but I've got some ice in my cup. I've got some oat milk in there. I'm going to add two shots of espresso, 
and it's called a cinnamon brown sugar maple something latte but since i don't have the plain oat milk and i have the vanilla i don't know if i'm going to add all that i think i make it too sweet so i'm just going to kind of wing this thing here and see what i can make so i'm going to go and pour my latte in here now and see what else i want to add to it so josh is done with the kitchen cabinets um we're just waiting now on the bottom cabinets to get painted and someone to come do our backsplash josh may end up doing our black backsplash but um He's done in here for now, so I'm gonna see how this turns out. And the guy just got our wood stove installed. Um, he's just got a little bit more work to do and then it'll be done. Okay, that iced coffee was not that great. I don't know if it was because the oat milk was vanilla or if it's because, I don't know. I added a little bit of um, vanilla syrup to sweeten it a little bit and that made it a little bit better but i should have just stuck to the iced coffee that i normally make which is just um the regular oat milk with espresso what else side to it some vanilla syrup and whipped cream on top so it wasn't that great so yeah it wasn't my favorite iced coffee that's for sure i drank a little bit but i had to pour the rest out so i just didn't like it anyway it's getting close to dinner time now oh, i left my machine on um <clears throat> Try to figure out what I want to do for dinner tonight. I don't know. Chick fil A was mentioned, but I'm not sure what we're going to do yet. All right, so supper was decided. The kids wanted Chick fil A, so I grabbed them Chick fil A, and then Josh and I got some Mexican food. I actually did not get my normal chicken tacos. I usually get hard shell chicken tacos when I get Mexican. But tonight I was really wanting some chicken fajita nachos, so that's what I got. I've got several of the kids with me. You probably hear them back there. And then several are at home with Josh, so we are in line to get the Mexican. Um, I already got the Chick-fil-A and we're gonna head home and eat dinner. It's already after 6. We normally eat dinner by about 30 or 6, but today's been crazy with the kitchen, remodel stuff, and then get the fireplace in. So, dinner a little later tonight and eating a little later. 